What's going on YouTube? It's Ryan Tapple, and if you were just wanted to ch uh, check your iPhone or your iPod Touch in the middle of the night, or maybe you're like right when you wake up in the morning, and the brightness just kills your eyes, it just burns. It happens to me a lot. Um, but this, uh, what this tweak allows you to do, is called Flux, and it, it is free in the Cydia store, and it, it does require iOS 4.0 or higher. And it is spelled kind of weird. It is spelled F dot L U X. So it's just like how you'd spell out Flux, but there is a period in between F and L. Um, so basically what this tweak does is just kind of makes, once you downloaded this tweak and uh, enabled it through your settings, basically it just kind of, um, it makes your screen or your brightness kind of give it that warm, uh, that warm orangey feeling color um, that just really appeals to your eyes and uh, that just kind of just doesn't, it just kind of makes it not burn your eyes when you first look at your phone in the middle of the night or, in a, or really early in the morning. So what you want to do is once you've gone, into, gone in here, and of course you want to en enable it, and um, that is at the bottom. And as you guys can see, it's, it's, already, it's already changed to the orange color just because it's 11, it, uh, it's 11.29 p.m. as I'm fil filming this right now. Um, but it does change automatically by itself. Uh, I think at 7 a.m. in the morning, it changes back to um, it changes back to regular to the regular brightness. And then around uh, 6:50 p.m. Um, at, at night, it'll change uh, it'll change back to this orange color. And you can of course change this the sensitivity to this. You can change it to fluorescent. And uh, you guys can't really tell right now, but it is still kind of purple. You can't really tell. Um, but it's but it's still it, it still makes a difference just depending on on your eyes and of course you can make this more intense by changing it to the ones up here or even changing it to um, the candle which makes it even more dark so as you guys can see it got even more dark but I'm just gonna leave it to the regular halo gen I think that's how you pronounce it and you can enable the long transition which basically means instead of just like when it hits 650 bam it just turns orange it actually kind of just slowly changes the orange it just kind of looks nice and then of course you can enable this enable or dis or or uh, enable it um, or just it, or, or turn it off if you guys are doing some work on your iPhone uh, or just uh, that this kind of requires um, or it is color sensitive um, I'm not gonna leave that on but basically uh, if you guys want to mess with this and maybe and see how it looks like when you when it uh, when it transitions to the orange or transitions back you can go to your general settings and scroll down to date and time and then and then turn off set automatically and you can set you can you can set your date and time and you can actually just mess with it a little bit and if you want to change it back just turn back uh, set, set automatically back on it'll change it back to the regular time that it was before um, so yeah this is a quick take I wanted to show you guys nothing too special but I think it's a really nice addition to your uh, to your iDevice to kind of just um, bring more flair to your iPod and it kind of makes it look nice but um uh, lastly, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. All my contact info will be down below as usual. Add me to add me on add me on Facebook. Uh, you can send me a you can send me a tweet on Twitter, um, or you could even uh, PM me or anything like that. Add me to Google Plus Circles. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Peace.